My mother and dad always said, yeah, you have to vote, otherwise you can't bitch. It's a historic election day in New Jersey. I'm Mark Diano from the Star-Ledger, and we're taking a little road trip today to go to some of the most interesting and historic towns in New Jersey to talk to people about how they are voting today and how they have voted in the past. Basically, this is the most democratic town in New Jersey. This is the one that has more registered Democrats than any other place. The flavor of the town is yeah, it's a working class town. Mm -hmm. it's a, that's very much the flavor. Like of, so of, there's 11 Republicans, 10, 12? 10, 12 sounds uh, about right, huh? Yeah. Hey, last year there was only one. <laughs> <laughs> that's the truth, there was only one One registered, year. anyhow. So you had two brothers in the Air Force, and you, so you're, you're very familiar with sort of that culture. One of the things talking to them is like they just don't want another four years to push. You know, that was definitely one of the you know, expressions that you get around here. I was a Bush supporter. Mm -hmm. I'm probably one of the whatever 30 percent of, of the people who are still Bush supporters. I, I, I think the failure of the Bush administration is one of communication, Absolutely. not one of not one of action. I think that every state mm -hmm. is either blue or red, mm -hmm. and it's not going to change just because of a candidate, just because of one candidate. You know, I was funny registered that Democratic, Democrat, and I changed to Republican just so that that way I could have a chance in the primary, because usually in the primary in this county is where the decisions you're made. The decisions made. Your, your family was one of the founding families of the town when it was chartered in 1921 as the first black governed town north of the Mason-Dixon line, right? Yes. Okay, so you, you're surprised I knew all that, right? Have you read it? <laughs> What, what does today mean well, to you personally? This means a lot. To live to be my age and to see a black man, Obama, running for president of the United States, it's an honor to be able to come out and vote. 